my name is Mohammed Shakib and this is Master Deck. So today we are going to install official Lineage OS on a Redmi Note 3. You have to must unlock your bootloader and install TWRP to do this process. So, so let's start it with uh, the rebooting the device into the TWRP. Then you have to, if you have a custom uh, ROM installed, then you hit reboot to recovery or else where press the power button and volume up button for a couple of seconds, it will boot into the CWRP recovery mode. So yeah, select the recovery mode and hit OK, it will boot into the TWRP recovery. So we are in the TWRP recovery mode. So first thing you have to do, make sure you take a backup of your previous ROM and then if uh, anything goes wrong uh, anything goes wrong with uh, that rom so you can in restore it from here so that is uh, that now you have to now you have to go to the wipe and advanced wipe and check everything except internal storage and a micro sd card then swipe to wipe then swipe to wipe now you have to go to the install there is the official lineage os uh, the build number is 25th of january so here is the nightly build kenzo it is a uh, this is the official build from lineage os so yeah so just select this and so now the rom is successfully installed now you have to go back and then install the gaps file which are here to select this then just swipe to confirm flash then you have to just hit the reboot system and wait for the for the boot animation So this is the official Lineage OS uh, setup screen. So let me just hit the next and select the language. So this is the Lineage OS on a Redmi Note 3. This is the official one. So let's just start this and and it looks kind of a similar to the Cyanogen mod and it is a very similar uh, to Cyanogen mod but uh, it is a different. So yeah let me go to the settings and show you it is legit here is the lineage os update let me just brightness so here is the lineage os uh, update uh, you can get a lineage os update from here so yeah let me go back and show you it is running on a 7.1.1 nougat So this is running on a lineage OS so yeah so we got the score of 67839 on this uh, official lineage OS so let me go back and show you what other things uh, we can find uh, there is no VO LTE is working on uh, this ROM as of now I tried to flash a patch on that so it doesn't work on this ROM so yeah, make sure that uh, it doesn't support a VLT uh, as of now. So in terms of uh, the toggles and everything's are everything are same. If we press on an edit button, here you can toggle through. Uh, so let me go to the settings and show you the what other things we get with this OS. 
so here we got a display adaptive brightness display over here and we got uh, ambient display also over here and let me go to the so here is the display size if you want to change a smaller one you can do that from here it will uh, smaller your display so I need uh, this one so let me go back and it will uh, do that so yeah I need a default one for right now so yeah this is uh, the default and let me uh, here you can change the uh, size of uh, font and everything if you want to have a little more smaller or larger you can do that from here and also here is the expanded, uh, expanded uh, desktop you can also do that from here uh, here is the rotation and a live display also present here so yeah it is on a automatic so let me go back and show you the other thing in the ROM and so let me go to the uh, the RAM is using is about uh, 1 GB as of now I'm not using this as a proper gaming I will show you after a uh, three three or four days uh, then we are conclude to the RAM management and all the things so yeah I will be giving you a uh, more more information about in a three days on this ROM so let me use it uh, for a couple of days and then I tell you about the ROM so yeah let me go back and uh, here you can uh, here you can buttons here you can enable a uh, navigation uh, button from here like that uh, if you if you are a left handed then this is for you and also you can end the call and all these things over here and let me go back and uh, the status bar is also here so you can you can uh, uh, status bar uh, you can customize the status bar uh, when you are need so yeah let me try out a front facing camera so front facing camera is also uh, a same but click the pictures but i think the camera is uh, a little bit of a buggy and if you are going into the video recording mode it doesn't record a video like that it will automatically stop recording so that is the problem in the camera section so let me just check out whether the flashlight working or not in this ROM so yeah flashlight has a same bug as previously it works sometime and it doesn't work all the time so that's that and what kind of a show so this is uh, pretty much it this ROM VOLT yet I try to flash a patch on that so it doesn't work uh, on this ROM so yeah that's pretty much it for this video guys hope you like this video make sure to subscribe to my channel and hit like comment share if you have a question uh, about this do let me know in the comment section below so i will be replying to every comment from now on so that's all thank you for watching please make sure to subscribe to my channel and hit like comment share and more videos like this thank you peace thank you